Aptara has a new section on their site for fleet vehicles. And these are some images, actually some new ones of Beta, which was interesting. If you can take a look at them together. This is just a flock of Aptera, Aptera. So not too much to see here. You can see these are pretty good resolution. There's some better images, but this doesn't show too much. It does show the door open here, so you can kind of see how it's actuated. And here's actually a new view of the rear of the Gamma, Ville, gamma build. So if we take a look at this area, I wonder what this is. I wonder, some people have thought maybe this is like a rubber bumper that sticks out, which could be, it could be a light for the license plate, could be both. This is the exhaust from the indoor cabin air. It comes out the back. You can kind of see some more design cues in the rear lighting. Kind of interesting. It looks like this foam stuff that's on the bumpers or on the wheel wells, wheel covers, I should say. Looks like they're going to be back here too, possibly with the light. I thought it could just be some red reflective material. So another interesting thing, just a different view of these. Kind of foam bumpers, you could call them. And here's how the side view mirrors would look like. And it's, there's a different view, but I'm pretty sure this is the digital camera and this is the what they're doing for regulations, so you could remove this and then just use the the cameras that's for right here for the side mirrors. And the other interesting thing on this photo is kind of shows the hinges for the the rear hatch, and then this. I'd imagine these are sensors or maybe some kind of cooling for the maybe the solar, or maybe to clean it like it would spray water. I don't know, any ideas on what this little part is? Let me know. And on the back, I'm pretty sure that that's the rear camera. And then in the front, you get like a better view of these front lights. This looks like it'll be pretty powerful front lights, and then maybe these will just be more of a highlight. We shall see. Better view of the kind of redesigned aerodynamics for the wheel covers. Kind of see some of the linkages. The cables were running down here, but I think I remember them saying they're, they're going to run them up here, possibly. But a lot cleaner. I'm surprised there's not a cover for this. Maybe that's coming later. Just a different view of the foam bumpers, the, the running lights, probably blinkers. And there's those side cameras again. So there's just another view. So I'm guessing that's part of the door hinge, this whole area here. We look back at this first one. Yeah, it looks like that's that. I do get the feeling that's going to be the brighter light, and these maybe just be supporting lights. Just another side view, nothing too different, but you can kind of see it pretty clearly. That's a camera, absolutely. And 
Let's see if there's anything else interesting. Looks like a possible another kind of way to absorb some impact here. I haven't seen that before. And then that's kind of the same kind of impact material, impact resistant. So kind of interesting. And I wonder if the hatch opens all the way down here, like it flips open. So the instead of just this area, maybe it goes all the way down. It's kind of hard to tell on this photo that's open because this is kind of a little bit out of view, but it could be you know, just just the body lines, or it could be it could open here and go up, give you a little better entry space. But hard to tell. Let me know what your ideas are, and if you've spotted anything else that I've missed.